Hey guys, we're uh, back here again and finally made up to my cabin up here for the range to do the uh, testing for the uh, Voltar A5 lower. I put the uh, Geisley Super 42 spring in here right now and we'll be trying some uh, good old uh, Lapula ammunition right now. With some good old Lapula 55 grain stuff right here. And I've got the uh, Super 42 in the rifle right now for the buffer system on here. And I got about seven rounds in the uh, magazine right now, so we'll run through the gun and uh, we'll see how the magazine, or actually see how the buffer spring functions in the uh, Voltar A5 lower. And this is the uh, 20 inch uh, upper assembly right here. This is the uh, FN USA 20 inch upper right here with the cold hammer forged barrel. So we'll see how the weapon cycles and functions with the Super 42 uh, buffer spring. I did swap out the actual bolt in this one because I had a spare uh, nitride bolt because I wanna try like a different bolt in this one right here because the um, original one was getting, uh, you know, caked up with a lot of carbon on her. So uh, I went I had a spare bolt sitting around. So we'll be trying that one out here as well too for reference points. So let's get going. Safe's off. Let me get you a good stance. Make sure this thing's tight on the front up here. There we go, that's good. Okay. Function great, guys. The uh, buffer spring worked fine. Super 42 guys leave buffer spring in the Voltar A5 lower. Function fine. And the ejection was about 334 o'clock, so I can't ask for any more than that. It cycled uh, the good old uh, 55 grain stuff, and it functioned great. I'll probably try some uh, more ammunition up here. I got some uh, Federal 55 grain. I got some green tip, and we'll try some other stuff up there as well, too, guys. So uh, stay tuned. <laughs> 